of Minecraft. So in the first episode, we kind of started off building our own little our own little place here um, within the side of a kind of like a small mountain. It's not a big mountain, just a small one. And uh, it's been useful to keep us safe for the moment. Though I suppose we're getting close to the point where we have to kind of expand out, maybe build a house of our own. Um, so that's probably what we're going to be focused on here today. Of course, part of that is going to be clearing out the area for this house. So let's see. Because this is going to be annoying. We have this little bit of dirt that's up here. Right above this tree that we have to get rid of. All right, go back down. All right, so we're gonna take out our X and we're gonna start to cut down most of these little uh, trees around here. Then we're also gonna want to level out an area around here as well. Oh, I forgot that you can run in Minecraft here. If you're using a controller, you just uh, tap forward twice. And you can run. How did I not know that? Or forget about that, more importantly. Get rid of the sand because sand, you know, fits your uh, the bottom of your area, and everything else on it falls out. Well, then you'll fall. So we'll do dirt instead. Of course, I still have to figure out the exact size of the place I'm building here too. Well, I'll let the, the the rest of this continue what it's doing. Is that a bat outside? That is a bat outside. How did it escape? But yeah, as we let the place turn back to night, I think we will go down and do a little bit of mining for ourselves. But some of this stuff will, will move in here. Bones I don't need, string I don't need. Hey there, Omar, how's it going? Seeds, I'll move the seeds and I'll move the uh, wheats as well. No, I want my buckets. I think I want my buckets anyways.
And I'll move the iron ingots just in case something horrible happens to me. Okay, um, let's make sure I have the right amount of crafting materials here. So the shears, I'll move those up over there. Put the iron pickaxe there. We'll add a couple stone pickaxes. And should probably add a couple stone shovels as well. All right, that should be ready to go for us to go down into the into our mines down below, where we can hopefully get some more diamonds and uh, any other things that we might need. My said it's okay and hard. I'm trying to talk with my friend while watching you play on my phone with split screen. Oh God. <laughs> Doing a lot at once there, Omar. A lot at once. All right, so we got some iron right here. We can exploit. What's our best bet around here? I mean, we could just try mining from this level. If I recall, that's what someone said. I don't know if it was you, Omar, or if it was Pickle, or... Someone said to mine from uh, level 12 on to avoid the lava, but still have a good chance of getting diamonds. Hey there, ghost and NCR. Got some gold here. Omar says it wasn't me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Omar says, yeah, I just opened Facebook in over six months, and sadly, I have little to reply to. It's okay, Omar. It's okay. There's not much that I have to reply to as well on Facebook, so we're in it together. So, yeah, uh, as you can tell based on the post for today, the mission today is to build up a little bit of a house. But it's currently night, so I figure I'll take advantage of it and do a little bit of mining here first. Oh. It always scares me a little when, when your pickaxe breaks. All right, we shouldn't fall from here. No, but there is this. And Sierra says, I'm working on an Ewok style base. You mentioned that in Discord. So is that, are you like, are you um, in creative mode setting up the trees or are you planting the trees? Go says you can keep your cave and make it a strip mine. That is always a possibility, especially once we get some dynamite going. 
We can start planting some of that and blowing everything up. Sierra says in the jungle. Oh, so you're working more on the Ewok um, buildings rather than the tree part shit of it. Okay. So a decent amount of coal down here. Although, since we have this source of lava as a fuel source, I don't think we necessarily need it, but... Oh, you're doing it in survival? Okay. Yeah, I've always enjoyed survival mode more in Minecraft than I have uh, creative mode. Have I played with creative mode? Sure, but it's it's not the same. says newbie name a sheep Jeb with underscore and it will continuously change colors I didn't even know you could name sheep <gasps> Oop, and we found some lava on this level Ooh. well let's see if we can pick it up I think we did. At least the lava that was threatening to uh, our, our continual progress here. Oh. NCR says creative is to make epic builds. I suppose. Thinking about it, I can think I kind of want to make an evil looking castle. Kind of like how uh, Vader's castle Rogue One is. Uh, Omar says, get a game, a name tag, place name tag in an anvil, change name, right click on animal with name tag, animal name changes. Huh. When did they add that? Ghost says also, if you put a bucket of lava in the fuel section of a furnace, it will smelt 100 blocks. You're too late, ghost, too late. Pickle already told me that on, uh. The last stream. Of course, one problem with trying to do something like Vader's Castle, I think, is I think I might need to get a bunch of obsidian to do it. Which is a little bit of a pain to work on. I mean, it's not horrible, but it is a little bit of a pain.
Hey there, Pickle. Uh, didn't miss too much yet. Just been uh, doing a little bit of mining while it's dark outside up top. And then um, once I go back up, hopefully it will be daytime and I can continue work on my house. And Ghost says, name any animal dinner bone and it will flip upside down. That's, um, I don't know how to respond to that. Also, I'm just hoping that there aren't any, any random, uh, lava areas that are in here. Oh, is that, that is gold up there. I'm finding all this gold. I don't know how useful gold is. I mean, I know you can make gold armor, but eh, I don't believe that does anything too special for you. <sighs> Pickle says, hey, you want to build the nether portal without using any diamonds? Fill 10 buckets of lava and get a water bucket. Hmm. I'll have to make more buckets. It's a possibility. I suppose while I'm here, I should probably pick up another thing of lava. Omar says, there's things you can do with gold, like train tracks. Hmm. Uh, which way was I going here? This is where I was going. NCR says, there would be orange dripping to signal there's lava above. Oh, yeah. So then I should be relatively safe. All right, is it daytime yet? It is daytime, cool. All right, so I wanted to do cobblestone. Let's see, so that's 90. I think that's what I need. Um, Pickle says, also later you'll want to go to the village because I know a way to make an iron farm for Windows Edition. What? Hex, hex. But no, that is actually kind of, that does sound kind of neat. <laughs> All right, so if I'm doing something kind of like Vader's castle here, I'm going to need a lot of room. Get any seeds that I can from around here. Sierra says, if you have iron and wood, you can make a shield. Oh, yeah. I probably should do that, because it's not like I'm using my, uh, my empty hand for anything. But 
Pickle says, villagers when in danger spawn iron golems. You kill those iron golems and get iron and then you repeat. Hmm. Ghost says, change my inventory. What, you don't like my little... The way I've got things set up here? Are you triggered, ghost? <laughs> Um, let's take that. Now, a shield. What's in the furnace? A bunch of blocks right now that I'm turning into stone, and then I will turn them into um smooth smooth stone after that put that there put the redstone away put the gold ore away diorite don't need that Gravel, don't need that. Sand, we'll put away. Andesite, we'll put away. Ghost says you can also put banners on shields. I think I knew about that. Um, how you do it, I don't, I don't quite remember. Oh, yeah, did we ever make that? We did not. Oh, son of a bitch. I didn't make that blast for... <laughs> Or did I? I think I did actually make the blast furnace, but I put it in all over here, son of a bitch. And I did sign in. I thought I signed in anyways. You were disconnected from Xbox Live to invite more players. Reopen your world. You haven't added anyone to your friends list. I have no friends in CR. No friends. Uh, Pickle says on a crafting table. I'm assuming you're talking about the uh, banner. Oh god, it's getting dark again. And they just started working. <laughs> NCR says put in Creeper Zane 8. Oh, hold on, it's thinking. Okay, let's see. There, I have added as a friend. All right, uh, Pickle says, 20 day minutes of daylight, 20 minutes of darkness. You got to keep track of time, man. I was just uh, mining. It was dark, and then it's, it's, I've only been streaming for like 24 minutes. I'm most disappoint disappointed. But now I'll, I'll, do, I'll finish cleaning up some of this a little. Then I'll probably just uh, sleep for today so I can continue... making my uh, little castle here. Our 
All right. Got all the cobblestone there. To sleep we go. We awaken. No further progress has been made there. Oh well. Oh yes, your bed plan that you were talking about. So do you just like throw down a bed and as soon as you throw it throw it down it blows up in the uh, nether? Or the ender or wherever either one. Here it says nether. Well, Pickles said you can do it in the uh, in the ender as well. Or in the end or whatever. I call it the ender. I don't care. <laughs> and I have to sleep on it and don't sleep in the nether. Oh, try to sleep on it. Calling it the Ender Pickle. <laughs> I'm showing how old I am <laughs> by calling things incorrectly. <laughs> Pickle says there is Endermen and Ender Dragon, but no Ender Dimension. Makes no sense. No sense, Pickle. Hey there, Crazy Nick. Can PC join my server? Um, well, it is. Uh, so I'm currently playing on the Windows 10 version of the game. Even though it looks like the Xbox version, because I'm using it, using a controller, um, I haven't made the game multiplayer yet. It's probably something that I'll do in one of the later streams once I get some things set up. You know, don't want people immediately coming in and blowing things up just yet. So in in time. set this up here Oop, and I opened the place up um, I have some logs or planks or whatever
I know I have a lot more dirt that's just waiting for me in chess, but I figure since I already have to kind of clean up a little bit around here to work on my castle, I might as well uh, do that. Pickle says, I kind of want to see what Nobi will do solo. So far, it has done some things right. Or how Nobi will do solo. Hey, I haven't died yet. That's more progress than I've made in a lot of games. <laughs> Plus, doing this solo right now, I can't get anyone killed. <laughs> yes, yes, emphasis on yet. Be gone, chicken. Do I have to kill you? I might. Omar asks, are you making a pool? No, no. I am, uh, the plan I have is to make Vader's castle from R R R Rogue One. Pickle says, wow, look at that cock that's there. <laughs> and there goes all my, all my uh, dirt that I had. Oh, well, I think I'll just return back and pick some up from in here. Pickle says, why not make Vader's castle in the nether? Because then I can't sleep in the nether. Uh, this was what I was supposed to do. Dirt, dirt. Probably should eat. I can heal up a little there. But yeah, all this all this forest that's around here, eventually that will all be gone. We'll turn this all into a big industrial wasteland. Pickle says, I don't know, man, the nether sounds like a perfect location for a Dark Lord's fortress. I mean, maybe, but... says get flint and steel and start lighting the forest up <laughs> crazy Nick thanks for the follow well what what does everyone else think should I just start lighting the forest on fire now I should have enough trees enough saplings to continue with wood and that sort of thing. And Sierra says you can make wheat. Oh, farms. There's an R there. And Sierra says yes. Omar says yes. Okay, I think that's enough yeses to say go ahead and do it. Uh. Da, 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 da. Iron, come back to me. I still have flint in my inventory. So, flint and steel. Check on this. Oh. 
Put the four coal there. Oh, I can't do it because I was maxed out on stone that I had. Have a controlled fire? Mmm. I know how controlled it's gonna be. Blast furnace, why you no work? <laughs> Unless the blast furnace only works for making ores. Pickle, help me! Well, let's do some iron ore then. So, quick move. Put three coal there. Oh, only works. Only ores work in the blast furnace. Okay. Damn it, darkness. But we can like the. Oh, hell. Alright. Uh, Flint and steel. All right, let's let's light up the situation here. Ow, ow, I'm on fire. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Stop drop and roll. <laughs> Crazy Nick says, you should make your server public, then you can slave chop them down. Maybe once I set up my castle, I can do that. Oh crap, we got creepers. Don't you blow up my shit, creeper. Don't do it. Come on, into the water. Oh crap. We got golden. No, don't blow up there. Come here, gunpowder. Aha. Pickle says, wow, Nobi, you have this fire under control. <laughs> like Luke Skywalker in The Last Jedi, just burn it all down. I will say I will need some nether rock to add some continuously uh, flaming uh, bits to my castle. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it. And Sierra says you could get flaming arrows and shoot them into the forest. Just shoot them through lava. Wait, what? Like, do you have flaming arrows that are in your inventory that you can shoot? Or you have to shoot them through lava? Oh, I probably should eat. Thank you for the reminder there, Nick. Alright, I don't think I need to set anything else on fire for the moment. Because this clears out a good area.
A little bit of leftover wood there, a little bit of leftover wood here, a little piggy. Some cooked lamb chops. Yep. Hmm, okay. I need to do a horrible thing. No, you can't set a pig on fire, son of a bitch. <laughs> and Sierra says you can do both or th through a fire, throw a fire. I'm not entirely sure how all that works out, but that's something we'll have to work on eventually here. But for the time being. Let's uh, work on the farm a little. I think I need another... Uh, porch over here because that one wasn't that one wasn't growing see you later ghost don't forget no stream Wednesday uh, so the next stream won't be until uh, Thursday oh pickle says the fire aspect is for swords the flames is for the bow Oh no, part of my area I had. All right, that should work. All right, next, food. Bread, 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 and bread. Omar says, sorry, I'm not talking much. It's all right, Omar. You mentioned that you were uh, talking to your friend or whatever. I got an achievement. Super fuel, power of furnace with lava. And attack and destroy a monster. No, come on. I guess it just took a while to uh, recognize all my achievements here. And Sierra says, once you turn multiplayer on, I'll invite a friend to do your dirty work. <laughs> Yeah, I think I need to exit and then restart the game to do multiplayer, so maybe we'll plan that for next Saturday. Depending on how much progress I do with the uh, castle and all that. All right, so grab that stone. Uh, let's put it away in here. And then we have the other stone here. We'll just leave our lava bucket there and get our stone to work becoming um, smooth stone. And then I need some more pickaxes before I head down. Of course, then I threw away all my stone in here. Is it becoming day already? Sanova. I 
Uh, let's see. Pickle says, build a stone cutter so that you can make different slabs and stairs for your castle. Hmm. Oh, I probably should have kept all the dirt I had. Go back, go back. Dirt and dirt, okay. So yeah, the, the dirt that I'm setting up right now is kind of just going to be the base. Um, the plan that I have is I'm going to have the the flat floor is going to be based off of the smooth stone. And then the castle itself is going to be obsidian. Of course, I know obsidian is a real pain in the ass to craft. Well, I meant not craft, but mine, because you have to mix the lava and the water and all that. And then you got to take it out with, I think you can only take it out with a diamond pickaxe, correct? Yes. Uh -huh. So that will mean having to find more diamonds and all that. No, son of a bitch, I overestimated. Oh well. I'll just go to this one then. See, Pickle says, with the enchantment of efficiency 5, you'll get it faster. But as far as mining it faster, or you'll get, or do you get more stuff from, uh, when you pick stuff up from being mined? Because I haven't really used any of the enchantments or anything. Ah, I have a traitor. Wandering Trader. Oh, this is kind of neat. He's got red sand. And regular sand and a fish in a bucket. But I don't have any em emeralds for him. Pickle says, yeah, mine in it faster also. With a normal diamond pick, it'll take about one minute to break one obsidian block. Ooh. I could use nether stone block. Hmm. Nether stone could work.
Of course, it means fighting all those gas or whatever they are. Not gas, a guest. G H A S T. The ghost things that shoot fireballs. Also, I'm hearing something weird. I think it's the llamas that this trader has. Also, the fact that there are wandering traders is kind of. This is like really neat to me. You thought I was eating beans? <laughs> some of this here. Don't get in the way, chicken. You're gonna die. <laughs> Punch the llama? What, does it spit at you? I'm not looking to make enemies with the llama. Darn it. Not yet. Although I guess you could probably go and kill the traitor. Hold on, let me let me put away any of my important stuff that I may have before I punch this llama. I can get leather. Well, we can get leather from cows too. Put away my buckets, my seeds. Uh, put away my shears as well. All right, welcome back, NCR. Pickles wanting me to uh, punch this llama here. All right. Dead llama. Uh, we got a lead here. Interesting. But the trader don't mind. Kill them all. And he's gone. Oh, he didn't leave me anything? That's disappointing. So I got these leads. I don't know what you do with them. Can you only use it on a llama, or uh, can you use it on other creatures? 
And where he says, we have a lead on who killed your llamas. <laughs> Is it for any animal then? Can I use it on chickens? All right, we got that smooth stone. Oh, used for peaceful animals. Well, let's let's try to use one, I guess. Okay, make it quick. Piggy, come here. Oh, so you can use this instead of, um, instead of having to do it with bait and all that. Oh, crap. Well, that's actually really useful then for setting up a farm and all. that away put that away you can also ride pigs if you want don't you have to get a saddle of some kind for that all right going back down to mine some more and see to the saddle Yeah, we gotta try and find some more diamonds here. I should look for iron. I did smelt some iron up in the blast furnace. I need torches. Crap. I knew there was something I forgot. Why am I digging three by three? Because I like to dig three by three. Why? What do you think I should be digging? One by one or some or two by one or something like that? Just go two by one, it's faster. Well, what if I find stuff in the three by three? All right, I need I have a few sticks, but I'm going to need more sticks. So let's grab where are my planks at? Oh, it's in my inventory. Duh. All right. Uh, charcoal or coal? We'll grab the charcoal. Omar says TNT your way through. TNT would work. Though, I don't know if it'll destroy important stuff. Pickle says you'll get you'll find caves faster. Now are caves generally where you'll find diamond faster than other areas? Or uh So I'm going to put the pork chops there instead, because I'm going to end up with a lot of bread over time, so. Caves equal easily accessible ores. Hmm, I guess. Oh, look, a cave. Kind of.
Uh, Omar says, also, it won't destroy things forever. They will become pickable. Oh, so like an ores and that sort of thing you can actually pick up with TNT. Uh oh. Oh, I think that's just, uh, I hope that's just gravel. But we do have some lava here. Pickle says, you could TNT, but you're going to need a lot of sand and gunpowder. Well, we have an all right amount of sand. Gunpowder, not really. Best way to get gunpowder is a witch farm? I know I've heard of witches. I don't think I knew that you could farm them. One thing I will give a game like Minecraft over, say, Space Engineers is you can build up a base and all that in Minecraft, and as far as I know, it doesn't slow down the game. Like, you can build things going all the way up, you can build things going all the way to a village, like a railroad or whatever. And Pickle says, all the mobs are farmable if the right mechanics are in play. Well, see, that's my thing. I just don't know what the mechanics are of having witches spawn or whatever. Diamonds! Omar says, not all the way up, there is a limit to how high you can build up. Oh yeah, I think it goes like up to 64 or something. Or maybe not 64, but... Yeah, it's not quite like Space Engineers in that regard. Around 200 in normal Minecraft, okay. Pickle says, you're in luck, newbie. Guess who does? You. <laughs> Well, we found some dirt here. Interesting, finding dirt all the way down here. And I hear the bubbling of lava, but hopefully we are all right. And if I do encounter it, well, then I'm going to try my best to run away. <laughs> Found the lava. 
All right, be very, very careful here. I think that redstone is directly on the lava, so probably not a good idea to try and mine that, even though I want to. And we'll come back in, CR. Found some gold. Better not be trap gold. Okay. Pickle says, I once made a farm for gas for my evil fortress. I let free the gas around for around my fortress for protection and a badass vibe, but the transporting was a bitch. Wait, gas teleport? Or were you talking about transporting for yourself? a little bit more redstone and then I think we might be able to just head back now we have at least a few things to drop off you can push the gas through nether portals and have them in the over overworld which is this dimension hmm I didn't know you could do that Did not know that at all. So that's what you mean by transporting, transporting the gas into the <laughs> overworld. It's on me at right now. Fudge. Oh well. All right, so we're going to go back up. We're going to check on the smooth stone that I have working. Hopefully, most of that is ready to go, and I can at least build the starting bit of it. Grab that iron. NCR says I want an Airsoft M4. I admit I am unfamiliar with it, but I don't really know too much in the way of Airsoft stuff. Put the redstone in there. Gold ore will put you away. All right, so Pickle, would you recommend that I maybe make a bunch of buckets to get that lava and all that, or... Because I have a decent amount of iron now. Well, let's see. 
I'll be able to make seven plus the two, so nine buckets total. And Pickle says, it was cool just to imagine a fortress of stone as lava pools out of its base and gas flying around like hawks looking for any player that comes too close. Hmm. All right, let's craft all the buckets. 10 for lava and one for water. Well, I have nine for lava <laughs> and none for water. So I need a little bit more iron here. But I can at least go collect some uh, lava. All right, I think I need sticks is what I need. You can do it right now. So you don't need to have like, you don't need to have 11 buckets to do what you're talking about. It's just with nine, you'll need to make two trips. Okay. I think I have enough room for nine buckets of lava. Or I have just enough room. All right, I suppose, oh crap. This was not a good idea. back over there oh fill eight with lava oops I filled well I can use one for one of my furnaces So we'll use one for one of the furnaces. All right, so fill eight with lava. I'm guessing one with water. Dig two blocks out of your ground. Do it over in the castle area. So two blocks. One, two. Place lava in the holes you made, then place water over the lava, then put up the water. So lava there. Lava there. Then I'm guessing put the water there and grab the water. Then what, it's one, two, three? No. You go vertical, not horizontal. Oh, you can't make a horizontal portal? Oh. Hmm. 
So how do you do these other parts then? You'll need to place blocks to hold the lava. So on the sides... Omar says, I like the delay. I can just imagine how much wrong this can go. <laughs> Shut up, Omar. So first things first. We'll go over here and sleep. That way we can work without any issues. Get cobblestone? I have cobblestone. Place the cobblestone next to the obsidian. Oh, next to the obsidian? Do it for both sides. NCR says private servers on 76. Wait, what? Place the lava on top of the cobblestone and water on top. Hmm, well just in case I destroy myself here, let's do this. Uh, that didn't work. All that did was make cobblestone. <laughs> On top, not in it. Oh, like, probably, like, right here, then. Okay. I think I know what I need to do. Because when you're saying on top, I'm thinking on top like a, uh... When you say on top, I'm thinking like on top as in like on top like a block. Welcome back, ghosts. Welcome back.
that there, put this there, boink. I have to go get the rest of the lava that I need. All right, let's drop off some of this cobblestone as well that I don't need. Don't need the gravel, don't need the diorites, don't need the granite. Dirt I'll hold on to. Also, since I, eh, you know what, let's take a moment and work on some of the smooth stone stuff. Like it says, it's confusing, but you're saving diamonds. I suppose so. carrying diamonds that's a no-no because they haven't gotten around to dropping it off oh son of a bitch oh does it come back as smooth stone it does nice so if I mess up I don't have to I was afraid it would turn into cobblestone if you messed it up. Put the diamonds away. Okay, Pickle. Okay. Putting the diamonds away. All right. Uh, yeah, I should have enough room. Okay. So let's go get the rest of the lava that we need. And that's all of them. Okay. Uh, Ghost says, what happened to building in a house? It's a very slow pro <laughs> process there, Ghost. <laughs> and Pickle got me working on the, on the portal to go to the nether. He 
You say the top part might be difficult to pull off. I think I could do it. I think anyways. Pickle says, once you have three high obsidian on both sides, place cobblestone on top of both sides. That's why I have multiple lava buckets here. Ghost says sleep. I probably should. There's nasty looking spiders out there. So I think we have everything for our portal here. Just got to take away all that's around it. Be gone, zombie. Be gone. I need to go get another shovel. Shovels. Also, here's a question. So, nether rock. Can you mine that with uh with a uh, iron pickaxe? And Pickle says, yes, okay. And Sierra says I should get mods. I don't know what mods to get. I mean, Pickle gave me a list of mods to use, but that was all for Java Edition, so... Alright, let's light it up. See if we did everything right. There we go, it works. Michael says you can't get mods for Windows. Uh-huh. I guess that makes sense because can't you do crossplay between this and um like the Switch version and the uh Xbox One version and all that?
All right, move the cobblestone there, move the smooth stone there. I should go in. Let me finish placing all my smooth stone, then I'll maybe venture in. you back there yeah I'm gonna need a lot of smooth stone here for building this castle Heard that cow there, and I was like, "Oh no, is something through coming through the portal?" <laughs> damn it, pig! I don't want pigs in my basement. Damn it! Pickle says there's a way to get a lot of cobblestone, but it requires TNT duplicators and flying machine. Wait, flying machine? There's a flying machine? I'm very confused. Alright, uh, let's see. Put away my buckets, because if I lose those, that will really suck. Alright, iron gets put away. Put away the lava buckets, the regular buckets, and the water buckets. Uh, I should probably craft a couple more torches here. I've got a little bit of food. Ko says, if PewDiePie can do it, you can too. <laughs> do all of this so I get a little bit more food before I go there because yeah who, who knows how bad it's gonna be there crap I didn't want to do that oh well and that one I think I can oh no it wasn't ready oh well all right replant all of you All right, uh, let's make this bread, and then we're going. Oh, and Pickle says you can make flying machines with slime blocks and pistons and observers. Hmm. I 
didn't even know they had added flying machines. All right, grab the rest of that wheat there. I think I can make seven. Pickle says, before you go, craft a cauldron and get a bucket of water. Hmm. I'm guessing you need uh, steel for that, or iron or whatever. All right, crafting a cauldron here. Cauldron, a lot of steel. Take those two items with you, that and the bucket of water. Oh crap, come back here you. All right, uh, put the torches there. I should probably give myself another sword here. I might need as well. So let's make a bow. Pickle says, if you catch on fire, you can place the cauldron down and water inside the cauldron, then hop into it to put yourself out. Okay. All right, I think we are ready to go. As ready as we are going to be anyways. Should probably have a good supply of like dirt here as well. Not gonna need the stone axe because there's not going to be any trees in the nether. Here we go. Building train. And I think there is a bunch of lava right in front of us. Oh my god. Well, this is a horrible place. Oh god. Ooh, crap! Is that because of what this thing is? I think that is. What am I doing? I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, you're talking about Omar there. Maybe. Omar says, playing Fallout 4, why does Stick Nick need a stim pack? He's a machine. Oh crap. Oh crap. Aha! That much I know. Yeah, you stay away, Mr. Gast, there. Don't stand still. Hold on, Inter. Oh god, we got Enders. Endermen. Oh, you can mine those with just a regular pickaxe as well. Okay. Torches where that is. Do I have flint and steel with me? I do. I know I can use that. Oh, yeah, use that to potentially turn on fires instead of using torches, maybe. 
Because then that uses the flint and steel, so I don't know. So we want to get as much nether rock as possible here to take with us back to our place. Oh, Pickle says, it seems the, oh, the guest hit my portal with a fireball and knocked it out. Okay. Well, I guess it's good I have flint and steel with me, otherwise I'd be screwed. See you later, Pickle. Actually, okay. I was like wondering, did I bring planks with me to make a crafting table? And I actually did. Uh oh, we got a little pig dude. I think this is what a zombie pigman is that what it is? Well, so long as I don't piss him off, I think I'm all right. I think, anyways. All right, you go out that way. I'm going to set this up so no one comes inside. Okay. And I don't think there's spiders in the nether, so. Ghost says, don't hit him. I know that much. I learned that from watching, uh... Uh... Peanut Butter Gamer and all his, uh... He does a series with, uh, hardcore Minecraft and... A few other hardcore games as well. Or games with hardcore mode. And, um... I learned one thing. Don't, don't attack the little zombie pigmen. Yep, because all of them will attack. Welcome back, Omar. Uh, just been mining right now. I think once I am done with this pickaxe, I might head back. All right. Flint and steel. Let's go. 
I do wonder what those these rocks are but all right time to head back home And it's night now. All right, so I have like 13 minutes to try and work on my little house here. Uh oh, it's an eclipse tonight. Flee inside. Omar says, no, the lag is killing me. <laughs> yeah, my main focus right now is to get the outside of the castle done. Once that's done, um, I can eventually start work on the other parts of it. Pickle says you can smelt the nether rock. What do you what happens when you smelt it? Does it become like smooth the nether rock or something? And Ghost says, I thought you left. And Pickle says, you thought wrong. <laughs> All right, well, let's make some new pickaxes here. <laughs> Omar says, he's Mexican, he always comes back. And Pickle says, good guess, Omar, but I'm not Mexican. All right, well, let's smelt this nether rock, see what it turns into. And Omar says, I thought you were, I thought wrong. <laughs> so we get nether bricks. Well, what do we do with those? Ghost says he's the Flat Earth Society, was gone for centuries, but they're back. <laughs> I don't think they ever left. All right, well, let me grab these nether bricks. Uh, let's see, red nether brick. Um, so two nether bricks and then whatever those squiggly things are. Four. Oh, here we go. Another brick block. Interesting. But that's a lot of work to make only one block. I wonder if I should make some more furnaces here. I think I'm gonna need them. And Pickle says, you're one to block, newbie. 
All right, uh, furnaces. So we'll do two more furnaces. NCR says anti-vaxxers will die from nat natural selection. Uh, in a long, long time, maybe. But it won't be quick enough, that's for sure. Oh, no, 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 don't use wooden planks, darn it. Pickle says there's a way to make a mini super smelter, but you're going to need a lot of iron. Got smokers here, got furnaces, grindstone, anvil. What do you need for the anvil there anyways? Blocks of iron, three blocks of iron and then iron ingots. Ugh. Omar says, I've placed the stream at 160p and I'm watching a guy playing an 8-bit game. I've never seen this much low graphics resurrection or resolution since I had a 2000s computer. <laughs> Oh, Super Smelter is not a block, it's a mechanic. Raining. Darn you, rain. So Pickle says, write this down, Nubi. You're going to need two furnaces, four hoppers, and four chests. That might be something we'll, that we'll have to do on the next stream. But I got the two furnaces. Ghost says, Nubi, do you have a delay? And if so, how long? Um, not entirely sure. And I can sleep during rain? Oh, I didn't know that. I mean, I knew that in real life. I didn't know that. You could do it um, in Minecraft. <sighs> Let's see, hoppers here. Omar says, what are you going to do with hoppers? Make sound with my bad jokes? I do have two normal furnaces. Well, three technically. All right, the hoppers. So what do I need for the hopper? I need five iron and two chests there. Um, kinda Omar, but not really. <laughs> All right, well, I have a little bit more time. So let's go down, see if we can get some iron.
Omar, was was your joke related to the fact that a hopper looks like a horn, maybe? I don't know. That's probably a bad place for that torch there. Hey, this leads into an area that I've already been to. What the hell? Omar says, what sound does a grasshopper make? And in what do they use it for? Um, cricket, cricket. Oh, for bad jokes? some gold is that a creeper wait what oh crap apparently it was I thought it was just a bat. Or at least that's what I heard. says I'm surprised that I managed to catch it. That was a pretty good catch. Or it says, fuck me sideways. In Fallout 4, I opened a chest filled with my stuff. And I pressed R and took everything into it in my inventory. Now I have to replace them. Oh. <laughs> fail, Omar, fail. Oh, there was a piece of iron over here. And another one. And another one. See you later, ghost. Hello there, uh, samurai. 
Yeah, we're currently uh, looking for some iron. I think I have enough. I have 14 iron, yeah. Because we are supposed to use this iron to make some hoppers that uh, the real, real Mike here in, in chat. Though to me, he's Pickle Mike. Anyways, uh, he, he wants me to make a little mini super smelter. If I don't find any ore by the time this pickaxe breaks, I think I'll just head back up. Oh, the plane with viewers? Yeah, that has to... That's actually more of uh, something from my uh, Total War Warhammer stream, so... Not yet, not yet. Eventually I'll get around to actually playing with viewers on Minecraft here though. Yeah, this is only my second Minecraft stream that I've been doing, so I want to start, I want to build up a little, build my own little castle, and then I'll eventually be opening this up to uh, viewers and all that. Uh, I currently play on the Windows 10 version of the game, but if you happen to have the Java version and had it from what was it? If you had it, if you have the Java version since like sometime in 2018, I don't remember when. Um, if you had it before then, you can actually get the Windows 10 version uh, for free. So that was something I figured out when I was planning to do this, all of this. Reason I like the Windows 10 version, I like to be able to play with a uh, controller. All right, so we got our little smelter or our blast furnace here. Throw that in. I don't have any more buckets, but I do have a lot of coal. Samurai says, I know someone who is a pro at building. She can help you. Hmm. Well, she's definitely, uh, definitely welcome in the stream. And eventually we'll get around to uh, opening things up to people and that sort of thing. Eventually, I want to build up a little castle out over there. And Omar says, oh, fuck me, I broke Fallout 4. Well, <laughs> what did you do, Omar? <laughs> oh, the crap. They're trying to come in. Or he was trying. I guess he gave up. All right, grab that nether brick, grab this nether brick, grab this nether brick, and now to build all of the nether brick blocks. Is that seriously all I got? Oh my god, that was horrible. Horrible! So is our little thing done here? It is done. Samurai, thanks for the follow. Uh, you know what, I'll just grab that ore back and throw it in here. All right, so Pickle said to make two hoppers and four chests. Oh, I need chests to make hoppers. Do, 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 do. And I need some wood. Omar says to check Discord. I will soon, Omar. Because, yeah, we're almost done here. Um, I just want to do this little thing real quick. One, two, three, four, and two to make the hoppers. So one, two hoppers, four chests, and you said two furnaces.
They have way too much stuff here. Way too much stuff. All right, so you say to make a two by two hole. Let's do it like right over here. Welcome back, NCR. So one, two, do, do, do. I didn't want to put that down. I wanted to put down cobblestone instead. All right, I got my hole. Now what? I imagine we'll need the furnaces. We'll need the chests. And we'll need the hoppers. I feel like I'm playing through uh, Fallout 4's, whatchamacallit DLC, um, the one workshop DLC where you can craft stuff and all that. So place a double chest in the hole facing you. So should it be at like the first area here or the second? Alright, says I managed to save and exit the game and I need sleep. Aw. Well, thanks for stopping in, Omar. I'll check out Discord soon to see what shenanigans you started. The first one, so next to me. Okay. Now place the hoppers facing into the chest. Like on top of it or like over here behind the chest. Uh, so Omar, the next stream, we're not going to have a, a Wednesday stream this week uh, since I'm going to be sponsoring on crap. So it's actually going to be the next one is going to be Thursday behind it. So put the hoppers there. And then the furnaces, the two furnaces on top of it then. Hey there, Sergeant Cupcake. The real, real mic in chat here is, uh... Oh, don't put the uh, furnaces on top of it, okay. Sergeant Cupcake, thanks for the follow. Yeah, the real, real Mike is trying to work me through making a kind of like a super smelter sort of thing. Yeah, I think it's probably your Friday or something like that, Omar. See you later. You'll have to look behind the chests. Oh, so I placed this wrong. Cupcake says, Sergeant or Samurai told me to go to Twitch to see what you're doing today. Oh, you're the friend that uh that Samurai mentioned. All right, look behind it. Oh, that's not it. Look behind the chest, then place the hoppers. I 
Is this the right way? Well, I suppose I can find out. I have a feeling it is not. No, you did it right. You'll need to hold shift. Okay. Or crouch or whatever. Okay. I didn't know that that lets you uh, place blocks like that. Of course, now I'm stuck in this hole. So I'm guessing theoretically now, yep, it falls right into, right into the chest then. Behind it, looking towards the chest behind them. Shift, looking towards the chest. So should it end with the hopper pointing, like the hopper being diagonal then? Oh, so it doesn't look diagonal. Pointing into the chest. Oh no, so it, it should point into the chest. Uh, yeah. Oh, it does actually work. Okay. Even though it doesn't look like it's pointing into the chest. Now place the furnace on top of the hoppers. So, ooh. gotta do the shift thing again. Furnace, furnace, okay. Now what do I do with the other two chests that I have? And place the rest of the chests one block above the furnaces. So not on top of the furnaces, but one block above. Oh, that's not it. Oh, I'll need two more hoppers. Okay, well, I think I have a general idea of what I'm supposed to do. You could have told me that I need the two more hoppers. <laughs> All right, well, I think I'll just end it there. Get rid of the blocks above the chest. All right, well, I think we'll just continue this uh, later then. I think I have a general idea what you do. You put the two hoppers below this, then that goes into there, then that goes into there. So 
I think I have a general idea of what you want me to do. Um, just don't quite have the time to do it though today. So thanks for watching folks. Um, if you haven't already, be sure to follow me here on Twitch as well as subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's where all of the uploaded streams go. And you can also watch the first stream I did of Minecraft from last week. Uh, we should probably do a raid here before we end it for today. So let's take a look. Um, let's see, anyone that I know streaming right now? Of course not, even though you'd think they would be. So let's do a random Minecraft stream. Oh my God, James Charles <laughs> has a uh, a Twitch channel. I did not know that. <laughs> and apparently he's the top Minecraft. Oh God. <laughs> burn the game, burn the game down. <laughs> All right, uh, who do we want to go for here? Raid James Charles. <laughs> well, do we want to raid James Charles? <laughs> as as horrible as that is. Oh, sure, why not? Oh God, no. Too late, Pickle. You've started it. <laughs> You've brought it upon yourself. <laughs> Although we only got two viewers ready to raid, aw, disappointing. And Pickle says, well, bye, I was never here. Well, fine then, I'll just cancel the raid then. <laughs> all right, folks, thanks for watching, and um, I will see you all later.